A 16-year-old girl took a gamble on a unique dress design. Now it's winning awards in the 4-H building at the Carver County Fair. Stacey Jo started dealing with her playing card idea about a year ago. Kate Raditz tells us how she stacked the decks. As I was rolling it in, I was getting some looks. From a far glance, it may look like an ordinary dress. I've never seen anything like it. Definitely creative. Some of them were like that condescending, oh, what is that tone? Up close, you can see the details. So tell me how many staples you used on this. Over 5,000. I went through a pack of 5,000 and then some more. Are your hands still sore? Yeah. It took over 2,000 playing cards to make this dress. Stacy Joe came up with the idea last fall after seeing a unique dress on Pinterest. I'm like, I gotta do this. So I couldn't find any instructions or anything, so I kind of just had to think of everything. She spent close to 50 hours fitting and stapling the bodice, and there were two different skirts. As the first one needed a redo, she had to find 40 decks of cards to make the final design. We went to Goodwill, and then we got like from family and friends and just donations and stuff. 40 decks. Stacy Jo used her own measurements yes, to make yes, sure it was wearable, and the designer became the model. I think they all have their own creative creativity. Stacy Jo credits her grandmother for her love of arts, crafts, and design. I thought it was probably the most awesome thing I'd ever seen anybody attempt at age 16. The judges agreed. The unique casino like fashion earned Stacy Joe first place, which means she'll advance to state. If you want to check out the playing card dress, you can find it here in the 4 H building at the Carver County Fair through Sunday. But if you can't get here in time, you can still catch it at the State Fair in two weeks. Reporting in Waconia, Kate Raditz, WCCO 4 News.